Great greetings, everyone. This is Nat. This is Jim. And welcome back to another installment of the SpongeBob Reviews. Today, we're ending off Volume 4 with a review of the Season 5 episode, Crabs a la Mode. So basically, it's cold inside, and outside it's winter, I guess, in the bikini bottom. And Mr. Krabs will not let the thermostat be turned above 62 because it cost him money. And Plankton overhears this over, you know, he's, and hatches a plan to freeze out Mr. Krabs and ruin his business. But he's in the Krusty Krab after hours and he opens up the freezer and he turns down the thermostat. And when the crew arrive at work the next day, the place is frozen. And Mr. Krabs doesn't seem to really notice or care that much. The Krabby Patties are frozen, so everybody follows SpongeBob's lead and turns them into ice skates. So everybody starts ice skating and paying Mr. Krabs lots of money to ice skate. And so Plankton, in the chaos of the ice skating, tries to steal a Krabby Patty, and once again, he is thwarted at the end. In a rather convoluted way, which I'll explain a bit later. So, first thing, the animation in this episode is really good. But then you also have the nice location and the nice shadows and coloring, and everything just looks really nice. There are some good jokes in this episode. I'm glad I don't eat here lines, especially the second one. It's a really, really good joke. There aren't many really good jokes, but there's a few pretty good ones throughout the episode. Well, that's good enough. But it's not really more focused on dialogue, and it's more focused on action happening and the chaos throughout the Krusty Krab. Yeah, there's, there's a lot happening in this episode. The second half of this episode is pretty much just Plankton getting a Krabby Patty and trying to escape the Krusty Krab because everyone is chasing him. SpongeBob is chasing him, and then the hockey team is chasing SpongeBob for stealing the puck. The episode kind of drags a bit around the middle. Then the ending section, where they're unfreezing the water, then freezing it back up, is perfectly fine, except Mr. Krabs finally beats Plankton by freezing him. Mr. Krabs is standing in the same pool of water, so he would have gotten frozen too. But I do like the ending where they turn into a swimming pool and Plankton's one of the ice cubes in Mr. Krabs' drink. That is funny. So overall, I'm going to give this episode three spatulas. And I'm giving it three clarinets. So this is the end of volume four. Thank all of you for joining us in 2018. And we'll see you guys in volume five. In the new year in 2019, in the future.